Hello everybody, this is an update on Lucky and he is actually doing very well. You will see at the moment that we're beginning to put a little bit of hay down on the floor for him. Um, and I've had lots of questions I'm going to try and answer now. Firstly, why he was in a bear stable and secondly, how does he poo? So I'll now explain. He was in a bear stable, of course, because um, he his insides were in such a mess he couldn't run the risk of being allowed to eat any of the hay and we had to keep his system very very clear in case we needed surgery but of course what does happen i'll just show you here is simo's here who's been looking after him and there is a mattress there that we move in for him to sleep on so prior to a bit of hay going down now, he did have some comfort at night. Now, I'm going to show you, this isn't very nice, but that's his poo. People have asked me, how does he poo? And how it's managed is, simo has been in this morning. There's Simo there. Oh. He's been in with um, Khalid. And what they do is they release the stitches at the back and they manually take out the poo so we can tell what condition his system is in and remarkably he's doing amazingly well on that they can make a judgment about the sort of food that we give to him he is the most amazing little donkey now i'm going to do a video later on but not now i need to compose myself first we are almost 100% certain that the injuries that have occurred are as a result of sexual abuse. Something that I think is quite important is I've got Simo with me now and I can talk about these things to the men here without any embarrassment and they understand that would not have happened at one time and it shows the progress we've all made together. But I will talk a lot more about it when I actually do a video for you all. So there we are. All the prayers have been answered thus so far. We're not completely out of the woods, but we're not going backwards, we're going forwards.